Hey Sag, it is Chaos from Chaos of the Divine Feminine, and I am here for your general reading. Um, it's going to be a timeless read. We're, we're going to see what messages. I don't have any specific question in mind other than your current energy. Um, welcome to my channel. Sorry, by the way. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe. I am a new channel, so I'm looking forward to growing. I'm so excited. I, uh, I've been putting in work. So I was able to get my first 1.4K uh, views in three days. Yeah. Anyways, let's get started. Um, angels, ancestors, ascended masters. Let me get clear, accurate uh, messages for those who follow with, under the sign of Sagittarius. Hold on, let me move back some. Okay. Um, let's get the current energy for Sagittarius, please. That didn't flip out. That one flew. Okay. You're moving towards a bag. You just got to get out of your mind first. Whatever it is that you're... Which, which, whatever it is that you're thinking about doing... Um... As far as business, whatever, do it. Get out of your head. You see this? Um, this is you in your head. I see you moving. I see you moving to try and get to here. It, it is going to take some hard work, though, okay? You got the, uh, the Seven of Pentacles. And at the bottom, I see you, like... You're going to end up celebrating. You're going to, what, whatever you're working for, you just need to go on ahead and do it. Stay consistent and it's going to work out. And like, cause you're going to have, like, you're going to be able to celebrate with, with those who really matter. Those who truly support you, you're going to be able to, uh, okay, let's see. Can I clarify this seven? Oh, okay. See, look. The Queen of Wands landed on the uh, Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, get out there, go mingle. If um, this is somebody starting a business where they, you know about little events, little mixers and stuff, little uh, social mix, mix mixers to network do it <laughs> it's gonna be fun and is like you're you are going to be the light of the room this is you're like you're gonna get a lot of people's attention clarify this eight of swords hold on too many cards what is this song that's on sativa get ready she said, it, she said, get ready, because I'm on one. Hmm. Give me another card for this. Okay, so you got the devil in reverse. Um, on the eight of swords. So I see you coming out of it, coming out of whatever this, whatever this boundaries, is, I mean, not boundaries, I'm sorry. Whatever this is, this codependency, maybe, you, maybe you've always been the type that you, you never just took a step on your own. You always have to like, maybe go to school with a friend. If y'all both, oh, you want to go get it? Let's go be a uh, do no tech. Come with me. Nah, you got to get out of that. Okay. You got to get out of that. You're gonna be okay by yourself. You can't you you can't always have somebody hold your hand through your entire journey. You you gotta pick your uh put your big girl panties on, big boy panties on, or underwear, whatever. And why does this keep coming out? Yeah. Did you recently go through something? A loss? You're grieving something. Okay, some of y'all, somebody might have just recently passed away. So this might be why you're in your, stuck in your head. 
you might have lost your support system. The person that always believed in you. Do you have any more messages for Sagittarius? Keep working. You have something coming. You're going to have wish fulfillment. Keep working. Stand your ground. Do what you need to do. Hold on. Let's see. Let me make sure. Because I do keep notes just in case I need to. Yeah. Stand your ground. Exactly what I said. Stand your ground. Okay, so you see this? You're going to celebrate again. So, focus on what you need to do and move towards it. Stand your ground. Okay? And you have wish fulfillment coming. I feel like this is a, a, a career read. Any other messages, Spirit? Let's see. Do I want to switch decks? No. Universe featuring, uh, from, by Ty Dolla Sign featuring Kaylani is on right now. Is this somebody that you're trying to manifest? Why so many cards, spirit? Okay. Oh, now I have another. Hmm. There's a Sagittarius out there. Somebody is waiting for love. Oh, shit. Hmm. You maybe want somebody that's not really... Somebody that's taking you for granted. Somebody that's not really... How did this happen? Hmm. Let's see. Because you have the uh, four of cups here. That's usually someone that's ungrateful. This is a whole nother storyline. This isn't a financial one right now. This is this is somebody, somebody love it. Somebody's uh seeking a relationship. Hold on, let's see. The fool step out on uh step out on faith. Maybe oh okay. So you need to uh Hold on. Clarify this full card. Oh, you need to watch out for somebody. Okay, so this person that you want, they are sneaky. This 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 is causing a lot of stress and burdens for you. You're overthinking this. We can't always have, you know, People always say, people always want what they can't have. Maybe you, there's a reason why you can't have this. Oh, yes, you in denial. You know, oh, so you know that this person ain't shit. You know, you already know. <laughs> you know that you need to leave them alone. This person is sneaky as fuck, okay? Nor do they want or care about your love offer. What should uh, what's what's the outcome for this spirit? If you keep on, you're gonna be the nine of pentacles in reverse. So this person, they might bring you down. This little sneaky energy. This might be somebody. They be doing some fuck shit. Might be a trap boy. Whatever. 
and you really like that. I feel like if whatever they're doing, if they get caught, they're gonna take you. You gonna you gonna be a you're gonna get pulled down with them, and it's not even gonna be your fault. You're gonna be guilty by association. So yeah, you need to leave this person alone. This is not. This ain't what's up. They ain't what's up. You have somebody coming towards you that's going to love and appreciate you. Clarify this six. I mean, this nine of pinnacles. See? No movement forward towards you. They, yeah, it was in reverse. No movement. What is this? I feel like you, okay. That just goes back to people wanting what they can't have. So this, this card usually represents getting everything that you want. But this one, this, this landed on top of this. This was what I was telling you, uh, you, you know, you know, this person ain't good for you. You know, they, they're on some fuck shit. You see how you got your guard up, but you got that one eye peeking out. Whoever this is, you know, man, you, yeah, you, you, you. And <laughs> let's see. Mm -mm. Justice, no. Yeah, you might want to be careful. Like, be careful with this person. Because you don't want to be... Let's see. Clarify this lover's card. Oh, okay. Third party. Mm. Okay. Okay, so look at this. What you don't see coming with this lover's card that I already pulled out. I said you have you do have somebody coming that's gonna that's gonna um that's going to be there for you. Like someone that's actually good. Someone that's going to appreciate you and wholeheartedly accept your love offer. These three cards came out. I'm going to show you the two cards that came out together first. These two literally came out together. Wait a minute. These are a pair. Look. These go together. You want to be this couple. This divine, this divinely successful pair, this power couple, so that you can become the empress. This is the third card that came out with the king of pentacles and the queen of pentacles. You're on your way to empress, to becoming an empress, if you leave the fuck boy alone, okay? <laughs> See, baby, lift me up. There's a song by Ty Dolla Sign, lift me up. Um, baby, lift me up, carry me. Oh, uh, what do you say? Um, climb over mountains for you. And fuck the shit out of you. Yeah, yeah, that's what you want. You don't want this. So, so what? Whoever this dude is that you are like obsessed with, it, you need to leave him alone. Look, that's you offering this non-emotionally attached as person. You need to go on that. You need to, yeah. You need to reach deep down inside and decide what it is you really want. Is this is this dude worth you possibly like getting caught up on some bullshit, legal issues, financial issues? Because definitely you're gonna lose money for sure. The financial issues might be a part of that. You might y'all might get locked up and you lose your job. So 
you need to go into hermit mode, meditate, think about what it is that you want so that we can man we're going to we're going to manifest this. Come on. Come on, let's work with me, Sage. We going we finna manifest what we want. So, go into hermit mode. Do spiritually retreat. Go like don't date for a little while, don't have sex with nobody, go within. Meditate, think about the qualities that you really want. Start thinking about all the other red flags that you've seen in the past. Think about what you're willing to accept and what you just flat out ain't going to accept, okay? That was your reading, uh, Sagittarius. So we had two two reads um, for two different groups of Sag. One, step out on that uh, business idea that you want to do. It is okay to do it alone. And again, my condolences if you lost your support system. Um, but you're going to get through it. You are going to get through it. That is going to be a success. It's going to take some work. It's not going to happen overnight. It's going to take some work. But that's what you need to be doing is stepping out on faith and creating your own income. And the other group, leave that nigga alone. Okay? <laughs> Love you, Sag.